Hello everyone. So President Donald Trump was speaking at a rally and he uttered some pretty pressing remarks regarding the situation in Ukraine and our current situation as we stare down the brink of nuclear disaster. Please take a look at this. We must demand the immediate negotiation of a peaceful end to the war in Ukraine or we will end up in World War III and there will be nothing left of our planet all because Stupid people didn't have a clue. They didn't have a clue. They don't understand. They really don't understand. I rebuilt our military. I rebuilt our nuclear power. They don't understand what they're dealing with, the power of nuclear. They have that was President Trump speaking at a rally. I'm not exactly sure where. It could have been Nevada. It could have been Arizona. I have no idea. But um, the fact of the matter is he just said something that you haven't seen any uh, uh, um, official um, in Washington, say, since the outset of this war in Ukraine, since these um, nuclear threats and suggestions have been becoming more and more consistent in uh, the talks between these world leaders and in the media. Um, you have Biden, you know, warning of impeding Armageddon and things like that. I mean, it, in a time in which it seems like the world has taken a turn for the worse, you know, our leaders that are um, const that are uh, in power c currently aren't doing anything in order to stop this, and they're agitating the situation, and things are getting worse and worse by the day. And here we have a former president, Mr. Donald Trump, who by no means in his day with some, um, you know, anti-imperialist uh, as it pertains to his policies, but it seemed like he has sense enough to know how far to go, when to stop, and how to do it. Um, my personal opinion here, Donald Trump is hilarious. Um, pretty much everything he says is clip-worthy in, in this clip that I just showed you. He's, <laughs> no one understands nuclear um, he loves touting about how he rebuilt the military, which is really funny. Um, but I would like to bring out how he says here in that clip that we just watched, it would destroy the planet. You know, this is something that I say on a consistent basis when I speak about this in terms of what nuclear war has the potential to do to life as we know it on planet Earth. And yeah, it quite literally would destroy uh, all of us in the planet and race us towards um, the brink of destruction. But there are people out there that I've encountered um, that may, you know, comment on a video or whatever that, that really uphold the belief that nuclear war, World War III, as Mr. Trump phrased it, phrased it in that video, no, it wouldn't be all that big of a deal. Most of us would probably survive. It definitely wouldn't destroy the world. I mean, I don't know where people get this idea from, but I say it's pressing that he says it because he's this is a former president. This is somebody that was in the room, that know the capabilities of the US military, the capabilities of nuclear um, power and weapons, and he's saying this. When is Joe Biden going to come out and say this? Um, it hasn't been done yet. All he's had is to say that he's giving more weapons to the Nazis in Ukraine. They're pressing forward with their horrendous sanction policy, the policy from uh, specifically Democratic politicians and Mr. Biden himself has been the same. It's all been in corroboration with each other and they don't seem to be changing. Um, but um, voices like this, we need more of. It really doesn't matter who it comes from or where it comes from. If people are anti World War Three anti-nuclear destruction, anti the uh, destruction of the species, well then I believe that they're correct and I'm not afraid to say that they're correct. But this is Donald Trump here against nuclear destruction as everyone else should be.